Tonight on First Look, we are hitting the highway and getting away. Now, Nashville lives and breathes live tunes. It's Music City after all. But it's also known for its rich history of boozing. Between the distilleries, the bars, and the breweries, you cannot go wrong. Can you say bar crawl? There are a ton of watering holes in this town, but only one holds the distinction of being the first brewery founded by a woman. Welcome to Jackalope Brewing Company. Dude, Jackalope is the bomb. They've made a big splash here in Nashville. It's right downtown. It's a great location. It's very vibrant. There's a lot of good people. This is definitely a really good place for weekend beer drinking. So Bailey, I have to ask you, what is a jackalope? A uh, jackalope is a mix between a jackrabbit and an antelope. Supposedly a mythical creature, but some of us believe in them. So. <laughs> the brewery got its name because a friend gave me a t-shirt with a jackalope that says believe in yourself. And is that what encouraged you to start a brewery? Definitely. I started home brewing when I was in Vanderbilt Law School. Just really fell in love with brewing. As it oh. turns out, brewing is more fun than lawyering. So you actually brew everything on site? The brewery is right behind those walls. Can we go take a look? Yeah, definitely. Let's go. So this is the brewery. Wow. This is not home brewing. <laughs> Each one of those tanks holds about 120 kegs. That's a lot of beer. <laughs> That's a lot of beer. Yeah. <laughs> definitely a step up from my kitchen. Just a little step up. But regardless of scale, the brewing process remains the same. There's four essential ingredients in beer, malted barley, water, hops, and yeast. It's quite the process, and it's brewed by a woman. Well, you're clearly a master brewer, <laughs> and I'm clearly a novice, but I do know how to do one thing, and that's drink. That's the most <laughs> important part. Today, Bailey's my bar crawl tour guide, and together, we're kicking it with Nashville's very own Pink Boots Society. What are the Pink Boots? It's an international society of women in the beer industry, and really it's just a lot of girls who are super cool, like beer, want to hang out and be with like-minded like girls. And you guys have Pink Boots. Yeah, yeah. This is amazing. So after throwing back more than a few pints, more beers, <laughs> playing with life-sized puzzles. You know it's getting serious when she puts her beard up. Right? <laughs> and plenty of picks. <laughs> I earned my very own pink pair. You are officially a new member of the National Pink Boots Society. They're pink, they're girly, and they're mine. Pink boots! Pink Come boots! On. Let's load up. Woohoo! <laughs> look, look, okay. Bailey. Oh my god! <laughs> One more time! <laughs> Next, Next we're going to Pinewood Social, which is a restaurant, bar, bowling alley. And the perfect place to continue our crawl. There's so many different things that you can do here. You have bocce ball, an outside area, great dining, great cocktails. I think it's one of the most versatile venues or establishments that we have here in Nashville. I'm all about the drinks and just the vibe. I just want to hang out. You make it what you want it to be. And after cocktails at the bar... Adrena's drinking skills are pretty solid. I'm interested to see how the bowling goes, I can tell you that. We're shown to the lanes. Let's bowl. Yeah. I've heard the more drinks you have, the better you get at bowling. Oh no! <laughs> or not, but that's not gonna stop us from more bowling. I got one! And more boozing. Can I get a banana man? I'll have jackalope, please. I'll have a jackalope as well. The key to a great bar crawl is all about pacing. I'm a little tipsy, not buzz, tipsy. I don't know if that's the same thing or not. <laughs> all right, cat. You're up, Missy. Oh, oh Can I bowl in my pink boots? Okay, she's it's really, really good. good. <laughs> it's the boots. That was so much fun. Where to next? You can't come to Nashville without taking in some tunes. So music. Robert. Honky song? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> The group has dwindled slightly. Lightweights, totally. totally. They can't. They're the lackers, slackers. But 
I think we have the real diehards here still with us. Professional drinkers. Professional drinkers. Here we are, guys. Robert's Western World is Nashville's only honky tonk that consistently plays traditional country music all day, every day. This is where everybody in Nashville who knows what's up hangs out. We all love country music and we all love to have a good time. And at Robert's, when the band starts rocking, the party does too. What do you think of Robert's? I love it. It's so packed. The music is amazing. I'm literally falling in love with Nashville more and more. <laughs> if you go to the dance floor, you will be asked by an old man to two-step. This is going to happen. Hey, I might get lucky tonight. Do you want to go two-step? 